Hi and welcome to yet another studio vlog. This is a collection of tasks I did throughout the past week preparing for the launch in March. I actually fixed the day. I'm so excited. It's gonna be the 6th of March. It's a Wednesday and I honestly can't wait. So yeah, I'm basically preparing most of my products in this vlog. Also, I got an exchange from my printer and it's thankfully working perfectly fine. Even though that doesn't mean that I did not struggle with it this week. But see for yourself. Enjoy seeing me prepare little bits and pieces and my excitement about seeing my products come to life. Finally. I'm gonna go and print some things, mainly the stickers right now and the sticker sheets um, because they're already ready and I can just work up a little bit of stock. I'm not gonna do a crazy amount of stock, but a little bit. So let me open the grid card design space and start both the printer and the grid card. Offset now, which makes it cut twice as much around and leaves these little flakes, but at least I can give it an offset so I have some color. Which, um, if it's slightly offset, it will still have color everywhere. So that's great. Let's go with that print. Yes, I will allow you to print. Oh, you print anyways, okay. So let's see, that is now the, the matte paper. I'm gonna quickly duplicate that in my Notion board because I want to keep it in my head and I'm not going to keep it in my head so so that's the die sticker no we want to know which paper match weather proof plus holo crystal stickers and sticker sheets then we're also going to duplicate this We set to the printer, it's coated paper and we set to the printer itself, it is inkjet photo thingy. Oh my god, they all look so cute! soon so I took the stickers out because I just want to turn the creek cut off but I need to figure out the right setting for those because it definitely was not just <laughs> one a one-time thing um, but let me show you how they're looking hanging on for dear life hanging on for dear life yeah, so it's it's not perfect. Like there's like those little bits and pieces 
which are hanging off of them, which is not a problem. I can just go in with my scissors and cut them off, I guess. Which technically is very easy, but you don't want to do that all the time. But yeah, that's... Ooh, you can't see at all and I'm sticking... That's the holographic glitter sticker of the In The Cloud cat and I'm freaking loving it. Oh my god, I love it. Mm. Those are the happy moments right after finally seeing. Oh, it's so cool to finally see them printed, you know, because you have them on your computer all the time. But having a physical version of your product is just... It's game-changing. It's so beautiful. It's honestly what makes this all so much better to have it actually as a product. And it can touch it and I can pack it up and stuff like that. So, those are the first single stickers which now... They'll come in here. Yay! <laughs> Look at them in there! Nice! Okay, so that's it for today. Um, I will be back probably tomorrow or the day after, depending on how the weather is really, because um, I might need to do other things tomorrow in terms of the weather. But yeah, I see you when I see you. Thank you so much for joining in so far. Um, today was actually quite of a good, productive day. I love when things work out and they did today. So that's great. But yeah, my future self will talk to you next. Good morning. Too low of a chair, isn't it? But I really want to sit on this chair, so I'm gonna... <laughs> okay, the sun again is super crazy, so it's very hard to keep a balance on screen, but good morning. I'm having a super, super slow Monday today. It is right now a few minutes after 10 a.m. and I am so tired and exhausted. <laughs> um, I spent the weekend with uh, a lot of social interaction and I also went climbing so yeah my energy is a little bit low today and I initially wanted to sculpt my new um, in the cloud keychain and I might do that later today, but right now I don't feel like I have the mental capacity yet to do so. Um, I've literally been hanging on my phone since I finished journaling earlier. <laughs> so yeah, I think it's a print stickers and sticker sheet kind of morning. So that's what I'm gonna do. I actually printed a lot of stickers yesterday. Let me show you. I printed a lot of stickers yesterday and it doesn't seem like much, but I was able to get all my beetroot stickers printed for my beetroot collection. So I got the beetroot latte stickers done. They're a little bit bigger than the rest is because I feel like they need a little bit more <laughs> space. Then I have a bunch of the granny stickers. <laughs> She's so cute. I have also some of the Be True To Yourself stickers with the original Be True in there. <laughs> And last but not least, there is also a bunch of the Baby Root stickers. And I think they turned out so, so, so stinking cute. I didn't film the whole printing and cutting process because I felt like... I don't know, otherwise you will just see me print and cut for hours. But that's what I did yesterday. And the day before, I did a few of the 
in the cloud stickers which are holographic or they have this sparkly layer on top and after further inspection I feel like the outline needs to be or the offset the white offset needs to be a little bit bigger so I'm gonna redo those and these ones are gonna be um, B products like <laughs> I might just add them as freebies and stuff like that but yeah um, I'm gonna reprint those and recut those and yeah that's basically what I'm gonna do until I feel like I'm able to actually do the keychains. I'm not quite sure it's gonna happen today, but we will see. Yeah, let's start with the easy ones. <laughs> I feel like starting with the easy stuff today. <laughs> oh, I am so exhausted. It's insane. It's so funny how my body can just not digest uh, social interactions very well. <laughs> okay. So while that is cutting in the background, as you can hear, I'm gonna take a few pictures of my room makeover for the thumbnail. <coughs> Sorry, for the thumbnail of my next video. So I can do something while the machine is running. Like this, the table is probably not high enough. Okay, I need to kind of take down the light. It's too bright, I literally can't see anything. But this cricket is now done. So let's make the beetroot one now. Done. I love it. And then one of the rows has a cut in them because technically this is not the right paper but I will never use it for a sticker sheet so yeah. It's because I never printed sticker sheets before I thought I need sheets which are <clears throat> divided into two and then I realized that's totally not true but I already ordered them they already came in and I will now use them <laughs> um, and yeah I mean it is what it is it wasn't such an expensive paper I guess so it's gonna be fine I actually love those they're so cute I love them even on this paper <laughs> This is so cute. Okay, perfect. Let's put them to granny. I don't hate it though, they're kind of cute. Let me trial them on the actual packaging. Just so you can see what I meant. It will just look a little bit cuter when there is a sticker on top when I ship them out. That's so cute. I love it. Nice. I feel like I said that already before, but... It's just beautiful to see things work out. I'm gonna keep those for me. Yes. That's cutting as well. Then we have all the bead roots. And then I'm also gonna do the in the cloud one. Perfect. So I printed those before but the offset was not big enough. I didn't really like that so I changed it up again. So those are trial stickers as well. Then we have a few beetroots where um, the printer kind of went over it and it left a little mark. 
So they are B rated as well, as well as some of the baby roots. And then, obviously, as I just said, the In the Cloud sticker, which came out perfectly. It just, it just needs a little bit more offset. So yeah, that's gonna be the stickers. I mean, the the ones which are on the bottom now, they will look exactly like this because they will be printed on this paper and not this one. But I feel like they came out so cute. Ah, I love it. Ah, it feels good when stuff finally comes together. I feel like I said that so many times in this video. But it's just nice to see it come to life, you know? It's very, very nice to see it come to life. template I really like CapCut. I, I usually don't do templates but hey. interesting. I actually don't hate it. stuff works out why stuff is working out <laughs> so yeah that's good Oh, 
Okay, so while my Cricut is cutting this second sheet of the In the Cloud stickers, I prepared two of the vinyls for the individual Tamagotchi stickers and you don't see me at all, I'm sorry. <laughs> and for the sticker sheets and they are holographic as well, but they have a lot of small little dots. And I have a feeling this will look super, super cute with the Tamagotchi stickers. So yeah, I prepared them. I, I fold one little piece over because they have no easy peel like my usual um, vinyls or lamination. So I just fold over one piece so it's a little bit easier uh, with the application afterwards. And now I'm waiting for the stickers to be cut so I can do uh, the Tamagotchi stickers and then we still have the My brain is not braining sticker The individual one the no self sabotage era sticker and the slightly uncomfy sticker Which I said before the slightly uncomfy sticker is gonna be a normal six centimeter sticker um, as a individual selling sticker but I'm gonna make smaller ones for the thank you cards um, as a freebie for every order. So yeah, that's still the four individual stickers I gotta make with the slightly uncomfy cherry sticker being two versions and then I'm gonna try to do all the sticker sheets as well at least like one sheet so I have them for pictures and then I think we have done all the stickers which is crazy it doesn't look like much <laughs> Honestly, I mean it is not much. I'm not trying to make it big as stock right now because First of all my shop is not launching until March So I still have a month to prepare everything But also I'm generally not trying to have that much stock Because I don't have the space for a lot of stock So I rather have a little bit less and see how it goes first and then print more and cut more when I need to. So yeah, that's, <laughs> that's the agenda right now. Let's keep on going. I think while this is cutting right now, because it's gonna take a minute for it to be cut, I'm gonna go and recycle and bring down the normal trash and stuff like that, because I need to do that and then I can also head to the shop real quick and then I will be right back. <laughs> Stickers are done, I'm back. Let's put in the Tamagotchi stickers. Oh my god! <laughs> Here they are! <laughs> this took so much longer than I would have expected it to take though. Love it. They all came out so perfectly as well. And this one is the one which initially kind of did not work out, which I guess is okay. Um, I caught it on the first sticker, thankfully, and all the other ones are perfect, so... Those are the stickers. They're so cute. I love it. Also, this probably fits perfectly on the thank you card, right? Yes, look at how perfect it is. I love it. Nice. Let's make a new canvas and upload. That was the Tamagotchi sticker. The brain's not braining sticker. I freaking love that one. It was literally me turning off the camera and rearranging it and now it works. <laughs> ah, send to printer. I see you back with the stickers.
different outfit. <laughs> but I did a few more stickers yesterday. So now we have all the stickers and sticker sheets kind of ready and we've at least seen them once so <laughs> let me show you all of them. I'm gonna start with the beetroot ones because I feel like those are the ones which I've been working on the longest. So we have the sticker sheet. It's so cute. <laughs> Then we have all the big die stickers, which is one, the beetroot latte. There's a sticker particle on my finger. Then we have the beetroot to yourself. Then we have granny root. And last but not least, we have ooh, baby root, which just fell on the floor. So those are all the beetroot stickers and the beetroot sticker sheet. I think it turned out so cute. Then we have the second collection which is in the clouds collection. That's gonna be so hard to show you right now because of the sun but ee, that's the sticker sheet. And here are the individual stickers and they turned out so good oh I love it then we have the Tamagotchi collection which oh, this sticker sheet I swear I just want to stick it everywhere also it has the sparkly layer on top as well as the mini stickers or the normal die stickers as well they also have the vinyl with the small little holographics. So those are all the collections which already have evolved <laughs> since I started preparing for the first launch of my shop. And then I have a few more. So I have the slightly uncomfy cherry sticker, which I freaking love as well. It's so cute. I also did small ones to send with as a freebie and I think the small ones turned out so cute as well. Then this is one of my favorite stickers so far <laughs> in my no self-sabotage era. Look at it, it's so cute. <laughs> and this is probably not gonna be a collection, it's just gonna be a single sticker. <coughs> my voice is leaving me right now. And then I am planning on doing a brain collection and it's the brain is not braining sticker and I freaking love him. Look how cute he is. He is slightly concerned because he's not braining. And funnily enough, yesterday I had to change the spacing between the N and the G in the back because there was a little bit too much spacing. And when I did that, my brain was also not braining and it was a full circle moment with the not braining collection. <laughs> I really... Um, had a laugh with myself right there but yes that is basically all the stickers and sticker sheets I have yet done and they all turned out very good it took me quite a moment for some things to work out um, mostly because of my printer setting but I figured it out like for example the the not braining brains, they were too dark in the first round. They looked a little bit diseased. <laughs> and now they're way brighter. So, yeah, I figured out my settings. And now I have a few more stickers I can just stick everywhere or send as freebies in the orders. And yeah, that's basically all I did in the past. 24 hours. It was a 12 hour day yesterday. Some of the stickers took quite a while to um, to print, no, to cut, uh, where I still need to figure out a different setting so they don't need as long as they did because that's very much not sustainable. Uh, apparently my nose is a bit rubbish as well. 
But yeah, that's basically what I did yesterday. I'm gonna do a final cleanup now because I'm not gonna do stickers today. I'm probably gonna do my in the cloud keychain. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. I think I'm gonna do a separate clay with me video for the keychain. Just so you have a little bit more insight into the clay process and I don't have to speed it up so much. So yeah. That's all for this video. Thank you so much for joining into this crazy week of preparing. I hope you could take something from it. Um, if you like it, don't forget to like and subscribe. I can't wait to grow this community. And yeah, we'll see each other in the next video. Thank you. Okay, let's clean up. making this all